Welcome to the Life in Ohio vlog for April 2nd, 2020. Alright, I got tired of recording vlogs in the house, so I thought I'd take my uh, little uh, DJ Osmo pocket with me and go on a walk outside here since it's about the only exercise that I can get today. So I walked uh, from my uh, house over to a... Uh, Hopefully the wind doesn't hit the mic too much. But uh, I'll walk from my house over to our park here. And I'm walk going on a walk. Just kind of talk about some of the things I've been thinking about. And to give you guys some beautiful sunshine. So uh, just kind of been... Uh, thinking about different things here a lot of people call this the new normal I will never call it that it is a temporary normal we're not gonna be living life staying at home not being able to go see family not being able to go to church not being able to do a lot of the things that we like to do uh, for the rest of our life this is a temporary normal there will be a new normal it may not be exactly a hundred percent like the normal that we had prior to COVID-19 but uh it'll be it will be a, no a new normal uh, a lot of times you'll see, I just had to turn a minute. A lot of times you'll see people talking about, especially in a church, you'll see a sermon or two where the pastor will talk about seasons. You know, seasons are understandable. Right now we're in spring, going to be going into summer, then into autumn, and then winter every year has four seasons but you have seasons in life we all have a life a season of life where we're children we're growing up we're learning how to live this thing we call life then you have a season of young adulthood you know, you have young adulthood that, uh, you know, a lot of times we make decisions aren't the greatest decisions in our life. Uh, then uh, you got adulthood. In adulthood, by adulthood, I'm ta not ta necessarily talking about talking about the time when you have kids. That is itself another season called parenthood. Okay, adulthood is that time period where maybe you're still in college or you just graduate college. All right, you made your career choice and stuff like that in adulthood usually. And then there are is a parenthood where you have children if you choose to have children not everyone has all of these seasons but these are the seasons that I have had not every time parenthood doesn't always come at the same time for everyone it comes it came when me in my late to early 30s you know um, it came for my friend more like right now in his 40s and 50s so it's just different parenthood's different for every child that goes through this stuff we're all child of God. So, 
but so just like uh, our general life just like the seasons of the planet there are other seasons and times in our life uh, there's like <clears throat> each little season of your life there will be things that change like for example when you change jobs and stuff like that and that's all this is probably going to end up being is a time period where where uh, we're gonna make some changes and hopefully to avoid temporary seasons like this COVID-19 stuff so and that's kind of some of the things I've been thinking about this time period we're living now where we can't go to church we can't go out to a mall can't have birthday parties that we've been looking to forward to all year long my son is the one I'm talking about here his birthday was just this past Sunday right but that's this isn't gonna last we're gonna be able to do a lot of the same things that we've always been able to do so that's a big thing I've been thinking about you know how long can this world and it is the world a lot of people want to say that it is a a uh, U.S. thing. It's not a U.S. thing. The whole world's dealing with this. Each part of the world deals with it in our different way. All right, but uh, life goes on, and you have to live life too. You know, there's some people that are afraid of going to the grocery store. And that's okay, I understand that fear. You know, but uh, if we live our lives in fear, you know, there's a song that says, Fear is a liar. It's true. Fear is a liar. Fear does not guide, it should not guide you. You shouldn't fear things you know got this shirt on here that you can probably see here it says God's plan and uh this is the shirt I randomly picked up at at a grocery store and there's a local store here in Ohio called Meyer and I think a thing especially for believers like myself that we all got to think about we all should be thinking about is that uh, this thing, this time in life, this time we have to look forward to after the quarantine period, after COVID-19 has been kicked, and it will be, all right? But this time period is happening all of God's will, all of his plan, all right? It's hard for some people to believe, I know, but it is. Now, God's not letting, you know, he's letting certain things happen because that is his plan. We may not understand why, the whys of his plan at this time, but we will eventually, so... Anyway, that's going to be it for today. Uh, family's doing well. I'm doing well. I miss my church family. Something fierce. Pastor Spriggs, Pastor Tabor. I cannot wait for the day that we have a church service again. Take care, everyone. Hopefully you can hear me over the stupid horn car alarm over here and uh, take care bye bye